All right, welcome to Stories with Smokey. I'm still not comfortable with this title. I don't even know if I'm keep it. But uh, <clears throat> this one, though, is a song I wrote time ago. Because Big Sean had a competition where when he was coming out with whatever album this beat is from, I think the real song's called like Paradise or something. He was like, yo, I'm letting niggas get their shit off on here. You can fucking win some shit. This is also like before, like I was really educated in the industry. I didn't realize that that was a marketing tactic. I was like a like a real like rap head. Like, oh my god, all I gotta do is shell this fucking sixteen. It's not that simple. That's why like that shit joined the Lucas be doing to like boast, bolster his company at the same time of kind of like you do showcase some niggas, but they're really putting money in your pocket the whole time. I'm kind of like this is a little predatory, my nigga. It's a good hustle, but it's a little predatory. And I didn't know that fucking that's what niggas is really doing because he's just fucking. It's a promotional team. You got niggas out here, and then also. Business tip for you little niggas. When you or I do these remixes on people's songs and they get plays, those plays, because it's copyrighted music, do get counted. But they go towards that nigga's pocket. And I don't mean the money. I mean, like, let's say my fucking video, for some reason, does a fucking billion views on it. And now that gets a nigga a platinum plaque for a record that never had a platinum plaque before. Well, because my record got played a million times and it was his beat. Well, now he gets a platinum record for that shit. That's what I mean. And yeah, all the money is well, but more so I'm talking about the numerical statistics that get counted by like RIAA and shit like that. So that's why I also, like at the time, I didn't know how any of this shit worked. Now I know these things. So I don't really give a fuck at this point. And I was just like, yo, I listened to this. I was like, that was kind of nice. That was kind of nice. I was a little, little nigga when I did this. So that's what this is going to be. Uh, this song, I called it Beware, but I believe the song is called Paradise. Uh, again, like I said with these, I will be dropping the audio. So if somebody does want the audio without me talking or stopping it for any reason, then boom, it'll be available. But yeah, let's check this one out. Thank you to anybody who checks these out. It is greatly appreciated. Let's go. I was just like, fuck, like, I can't believe I did this. Like, I was killing this beat. I was little, I was still, I think I was still, like, in college when I did this shit. And I was just like, fucking hell, like, look at me. Look at me. I'm going to win this shit. I had no idea how rigged the game was. <laughs> Man, but I ain't tripping because I got it. That's what happens when you try to be iconic. Uh -huh. Do it for the love, but then they hate you. It's ironic. That's right. I ain't tripping. Uh-uh. Cause I got it Syllable assassin Putting verses in caskets Get it, flip it, double, triple That is how you stack it Practice, I've been had It's showtime, I'm magic Sicker than anybody But can't tell that he has it I saw Bar for years I'm just like I don't think anybody fucking gets Showtime, magic Sicker than anybody But can't tell that he has it I'm just like Oh my god Just like There's so many levels right here And just for time I just I don't think anybody fucking ever or if they did, they never said nothing to me. It's probably like how you guys feel. Uh, if any, if the homies from the uh, Reese videos watch this, uh, y'all always be like, "Oh, you missed that bar." I'm like, "Nah, bro. Like, I just, 
I heard it, but like it probably just wasn't that crazy. I'm just not gonna talk about it, but I heard it. That's probably like how some people probably did me. It's just like, yo, I heard the bar it was nice, it was spicy. It's just all right, cool. Like it's a good bar. And just kept it pushing. <laughs> Passion is pushing me to write rappers eulogies. Your favorite rappers faces on your shirt. Sure you swap me. me. Another obstacle or hurdle can't no one stop me. This BS from rejects who water their product. Better beware when I'm near cause I'm killing that garbage. Better bow your head, say a prayer, and pay me some homage. Uh. Nigga, I ain't cocky, I'm just confident. Word play alone got me on another continent. Linguistically, I'm gifted. Spit it, you seen the vision. You seen it cause you heard it, you felt it cause it was vivid. Timmy never been that. Christmas Day with these gift rats. Journalist the name, make sure that you don't forget that. Uh, I heard it's all about a dollar, dollar. And the devil wears Prada, Prada. And the devil's in the details. Money make a man like females. I heard it's all about a dollar, dollar. And the devil wears Prada. Riders and killers who gon' ride for your nigga, talking just like the siblings that I was born with. I make enough of this money, I don't have no more worries. Cause I started out in debt, young black, and I'm hungry to make it to my age in the city. You gotta be lucky, not to be behind them bars or facing the jury. But I ain't tripping off the crack and still pull it up. You know we living for the moment, not the consequences. But we just blame it on our youth like we don't know enough. You know this fast life and bright lights be claiming victims. So if you say you bad it, you better live about it. Cause there's some niggas out here who don't play, they live about it. And who the fuck wanna fake them when it's time to be bad? Cause I'm just asking, I'm like, you know, I'm bad about it. Yeah, yeah. When I did this shit, I thought I was the hottest shit. I still fucking in school. I thought I was gonna fucking win this shit. I had a crazy fucking internship at an amazing fucking studio. Oh my god. Like I did the mix, like all cert- certain shit that's like on this song, like this song's not actually formatted this way. Like I did so much to this fucking song to like kind of like make it my own. Like I really tried to win that fucking competition and then it just turned into Oh. Yeah, that's how that, that that's how that works, huh? Oh, okay. It was a promotional effort. That shit, like, where's the kid that won this? I don't fucking know. I don't even fucking hear who fucking won. I just know I lost because them niggas didn't call me. And it's how many years later? Terrible. Terrible. I was heartbroken. I was like, I gave my all. I was in this bitch shelling. I was going off. I was a little nigga. I went from not being able to rhyme to doing this. And you niggas just, you, what? <laughs> Nothing. Not a damn thing. Nothing at all. But yeah. I was this, uh, we'll say, what is it, the time I tried to fucking win a Big Sean competition, I guess. But yeah, that's what this song was from. Uh, it's for sure an older record, but uh, I kind of just figured it'd be best to kind of show you guys some of like, my early day shit that I could like actually be like still proud of. Like, yo, I don't even fucking, if a nigga listen to this, like, yo, you was getting the fuck off. I'd be like, motherfucker, right, you my dog. You get it. You seen the vision. Like, I, I get it's old. It's not like, it's not patterned properly. I'm not by any means being like, oh, this is the greatest shit ever, but it's like, uh, Listening to like Jay Z, nah, I'm not. I'm not putting myself there. I ain't making no piece like that. Not even close. I'm just saying it's like listening to that nigga like on that Big L freestyle, where it's like, oh, okay, I see where you came from, my nigga. I see where some of the stuff that you do now, like that was a tool in your bag years ago. Like that was the journey. Okay, that's what's up. That's what's up. That's kind of more so what these are for me as well, because I just be like, damn, this shit dead. But now that I know I could just put these bitches on YouTube and shit again, I just like maybe. Maybe this would be a way to, like, kind of, like, hey, this was this. You want to hear it? It's over there. Maybe niggas be like, hey, I like this. Who knows? I don't know. But, yeah, fuck it. Fucking around on the internet now. So that's kind of how this is going to go. So thank you to anybody who checks this out. It is greatly appreciated. If you made it through to the end of any of these, like, one, thank you. Like, I don't know why you clicked on my stuff, but I really do appreciate it. And then, two, could you please hit that like and subscribe if you made it all the way through to the end? Because I really do need to grow the channel. We are trying to make this something real over here. Yeah, see you guys on the next one. I'm out of here.